What makes the US Navy's F-35C so special compared to the other versions? Well, even though it shares a lot of the same high-tech brains as the F-35A and B, it's actually a very different beast under the hood. Since it's built specifically for life on an aircraft carrier, it has to handle some pretty wild conditions. From being blasted off a catapult to slamming down onto a moving deck, the C model is definitely the toughest member of the family. The first thing you'll probably notice is the wings. They're huge. At 43 feet wide, they're about 8 feet broader than the wings on the other models. This extra size isn't just for show, it gives the pilot a lot more lift and helps the jet stay steady when it's coming in for a slow landing at sea. And since space is always at a premium on a carrier, the wingtips actually fold up. It's a classic Navy move that makes it way easier to park the jet side by side in the hangar. Now, landing on a carrier isn't exactly a smooth experience. It's often called a controlled crash. To handle that kind of daily punishment, the F-35C is reinforced from the inside out. It features super heavy-duty landing gear and a double-wheel nose gear to manage those intense catapult launches. Even the tail hook is bigger and more rugged than the ones on the other variants, ensuring it can snag an arresting wire and stop on a dime every single time. The F-35C also wins the prize for carrying the most gas. Since it doesn't have a bulky lift fan like the Marine version or a built-in gun like the Air Force model, engineers filled all that extra space with fuel tanks. It can carry nearly 20,000 pounds of fuel internally, which is the most in the F-35 family. That means it can fly further, stay over the target longer, and get the job done without having to constantly look for a tanker for a refill. At the end of the day, the F-35C is a total game-changer for the fleet. It's currently the only stealth fighter in the world that can operate from these massive supercarriers. By talking to all the other ships and planes in the area, it helps the whole team stay safe and see exactly what's happening in the sky. It's tough, it's smart, and it definitely gives the Navy a massive edge out on the open ocean. <laughs>